Uh, thank you for joining me. This is probably the final video I'll do today on walking along the old railway line from Leek to Stoke-on-Trent. All further videos will be done on my next outing. I feel now we're coming to the end of the Staffordshire countryside into the beginning of the suburbia of Stoke-on-Trent. I'm on what now appears to be another section which is used as a permissive path so people can walk along here and people clearly do walk along here. Um, we're just coming, there's the canal down there, the Calden Canal. And just get through these bushes. And we're now coming to, there's a rather strange bit of fence in here, but there's some open gates and people clearly have been through them. So I think it's all right to proceed. I'm not really sure what the purpose of this fencing is, but the fact that the gate is open um, seems to suggest it doesn't really need to be here. Anyway, so I'm now on the bridge over the old canal or should I say I'm on the old bridge over the canal because the canal well it's old but it's still in, it's old in the railway but at least it's still in use unlike the railway so that's looking that way towards Kings Inn Foggle and looking down there that goes towards Stoke in fact I can just see now whether the camera is going to pick it out if you look See where that pipe is down there, just in front of it is a sign, you probably won't be able to read it, but it tells you how far now. It says a Turia 5 miles that way, and you talk to 25 miles that way, you can't actually get to you talk to by canal anymore, unfortunately. You can only go as far as Kings in Foggle. So we now come to um, be easy just to go through there into a housing estate and have to not clamber through anymore, but we are coming close to the site of Milton Station, and that's what I wanted to show you in the final video of today. Next time I shall make my way to Milton and I will carry on walking through where I can, through the much more urbanised parts of this former railway, through Stoke-on-Trent. Whether it will all be as accessible as this has been, I really don't know. Um, it could be that not every section is as accessible, but this bit here this section seems fairly accessible. So um, somewhere along here, I'm hoping we'll find Milton Station. I know it's near where the road from Leek to Stoke crosses the old railway, and um, you can possibly hear the noise of the traffic. So we are fast approaching the road. I can just make out the bridge you probably can't see it for all these trees but it is there you'll see it clearly in a minute I expect you can hear the traffic so should they ever reopen this this would be a very useful place to have a station again in Milton um, because it would clearly be well used for people traveling into Stoke and in the other direction it almost makes you think if they were to reopen the station here is possibly an obvious site the waste ground they can almost Imagine all these trees being cut down um, and there being a platform here, a little car park, a, maybe a modern station building, perhaps have a cafe. You could sit here and wait for your train. There could be steam trains still passing through. It could be a bit of both heritage and a commuter line. Now, you can clearly see we've come to the bridge. We'll certainly go under the bridge. Whether we'll get any further, oh, I don't know. I'm tripping over. Sorry. Like I said, it's tripwires everywhere, these brambles. And it had just been raining, so everything's a lot wetter now. Um, right, okay, well, we're into the bridge. I seem to put these extra strengthening girders up. I have a feeling we might not get any further. It looks very overgrown. Um, can we? Yeah, perhaps we can. So I think now, yeah, yeah, we can get round here. I'm just going round, and there's appears to be a bit of a, a path. It's a shame to think I've come now to do so much of it, just that section after Endon, that I couldn't do. Now, it looks as though I think we found the old station, because what, what I can see here, the track is there, but the path kind of goes up a bit. That must be the old platform, so let's go and have a look, see if we have found the old platforms. I mean, it'd be nice when I walk along an old railway, I kind of like to walk from one former station to another former station. So a bit like you've been on the train kind of thing. So yeah, this is the station platform at End, not Endon, at uh, Milton. Platform's still here, all but overgrown. So that way is looking towards the old road bridge. 
and then this way you can clearly see the line of the station platform and the track is still down there interestingly there has been track laid all the way so although the track isn't in quite as good condition as it was before Endon cut all the trees down you could technically I wouldn't suggest bringing a locomotive along here but I might suggest bringing a Wigan rail trolley or one of those pump trucks I think one of them could come along here quite easily I believe somewhere along here the station building does survive or at least the former station master's house so whether we'll be able to find that I don't know and then I'm gonna try and get out of here um, and get back to the road I need to get a bus back it's very it feels like a very long platform whether it's because it's overgrown and I can't really see where I'm going I don't know but it's a very strange feeling walking along here there's the track and you just imagine a steam train perhaps like a 4MT or like a Fairburn tank with a couple of carriages pulling in here with a train taking people to work in Stoke or taking them the other way out for a day at Rudyard Lake yeah it's a shame really to see it the station like this it there only ever was this one platform um, it's quite a wide platform it's almost like here there's room for two tracks but no not two tracks and two platforms so see how various stones are missing along there and we're coming to the bridge so I'm really hoping when I get to this bridge I can get out um, and I'm going to come back to this another day where, at some point and um, you'll be able to as I said when I make these videos I'm making them over a few days but I'm not we're going to release them all in one go two days apart so you get the the contingency rather than me make a few then you've got to wait a couple of months while I go out and, until I can get around to going out and making another one um, well we come to a bridge that's looking that way to, across the old station so you can just see that way looking towards Leek and then here looking towards Stoke is the bridge I've come to the end of the platform so I'm going to now try and get out that might be easier said than done I think if I really can't get out here I'm not sure whether to go back to where we crossed the canal or um, carry on so um, oh yeah I can get out of there right so we are going to just stand on the track one last time we're going to leave this video here that is the old railway station that's what I need a ladder <laughs> it looks like the ladder's going by itself but of course it's on top of a van um, anyway so that is looking looking towards leak and it looks like I'm going to have a fairly easy job at least to start with could be deceiving sometimes I think oh that's easy I can walk along there and then you get round the corner it's all overgrown so that's looking towards Stoke so I'm going to leave this video here now I'm going to climb up out of here so thank you very much for watching from Milton Station goodbye